In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to save your response in Microsoft Forms. Whether you're an educator collecting data or simply using forms for personal projects, knowing how to let respondents save and edit their responses can be incredibly beneficial. We'll walk through the steps needed to allow this handy feature. First, let's start by navigating to the Microsoft Forms website. Once you're there, you'll want to open the specific form or quiz that you want to work with. This is the starting point for making any changes or reviewing the settings that allow responses to be saved. Once you've opened the form, look to the top right corner of your screen for the three dots or the gear icon. Clicking on this will open up a menu with various options, providing you with the settings you need to adjust. Scroll down through the settings menu until you find the responses section. Here you'll see an option to enable a checkbox that says allow respondents to save their responses. By checking this box, you give respondents the opportunity to save their answers midway through a form or quiz, which can be a game changer for lengthy surveys or quizzes requiring extensive input. Within this section, you'll also see another setting that allows respondents to edit their responses after submission. Consider enabling this option if you think your respondents might need to make corrections or updates to their answers after they've already submitted them. This can be particularly useful in educational environments or during collaborative projects. Now, once these settings are configured, it's important to understand the experience from the respondent's perspective. After completing the form, the respondent will click Submit. Once they do, they will be greeted with a thank you page that also provides an option to save my response to edit. This option needs to be selected to ensure that their response is saved correctly. Respondents can access their saved responses by navigating to Filled Forms in the Microsoft Office web application. This is a centralized location where all forms that have been completed yet not finalized are stored. From here, respondents can select any saved form to view and, if necessary, make any changes to their previous entries. Finally, once the desired changes have been made, ensure that the form is resubmitted to update the responses. This makes certain all the information you've taken the time to correct is stored accurately. And there you have it. Following these steps will help you enable response saving in Microsoft Forms, providing both you and your respondents with greater flexibility and convenience. Thank you for watching and make sure to subscribe for more helpful tips on using Microsoft Office products.